on private jets. Here they are inside the ring, and we are underway. They don't even. Eddie Hearn predicts Daniel Dubois will freeze. Anthony Joshua will win in round three. Anthony Joshua's promoter Eddie Hearn has made a stunning prediction ahead of Joshua's heavyweight showdown with Daniel Dubois on Saturday night at Wembley. Hearn believes Dubois will squirm under the pressure and end up getting knocked out by Joshua inside the first three rounds. Great left hand by. Long shot from Paul Jab also. But that According to Hearn, the win is huge for Joshua, now 34, as it would open up a much bigger opportunity for a fight with Tyson Fury in early 2025. Being, that was the punch you were talking about, where he was on unsteady legs there. Gold Fletch. If Joshua fails and is brutally knocked out by Dubois in front of a crowd of 96,000, any point, chance of facing change, Fury so. could be lost. There's a cracking punch there for Fury. Uh, and things. Two to go. Oh, that's better again from Fury. Hearn, who appears to be desperate for Joshua to win, is aware of the importance of the fight not only for Joshua, but also for their future boxing careers. Sean Porter's got it all scored. Oh, that's better. Especially with the point deduction, so... If Joshua loses, fans will demand a rematch with Dubois, as was the case in 2019 when Joshua lost to Andy Ruiz Jr. Begs there. Solid Sledge. Especially with the point deduction, so... There's a cracking punch there from Fury. However, this time around the situation is different. Dubois is a much younger and fitter fighter than Ruiz, who famously suffered a physical setback ahead of their rematch in December 2019. In an interview with Charlie Parson's YouTube channel, Hearn expressed his belief that Dubois would be nervous about facing Joshua under the spotlight. Also, but that's his danger shot back from Fury. But the danger is there. Oh, that's better again from Fury back. But this is that's been a good. There's a nice jab there. Final round. So the fuck, Charles Frost. Daniel Dubois will be absolutely frozen in this situation. Hearn said. There's a nice jab there. Final round. So the fault, Carl Frost has got a wide lead. For this is However, Hearn also warned that while Dubois may look tense, he can still pose a serious threat. Oh, that's better again from Fury. When Dubois is frozen, he doesn't just stand there letting AJ hit him. He'll come back with a really dangerous right hand. So the fault, Carl Frost. So the fuck, Charles Frost has got a wide lead for both. This is good. Down. There's a nice jab there. It could be a short three-round fight, but it'll be very exciting. So the fuck, Charles added. Frost has got a wide lead for both. This is good. Down goes Tommy Fury. He says it was a slip. The referee's giving a count. Joshua's mental and physical condition are also a concern. According to Hearn, Joshua needs to address his poor cardio history, especially against opponents who are good at returning punches. When facing opponents who are constantly on the attack, Joshua often seems to tire more quickly, which could be a weak point for Dubois to exploit. When he's off balance and he's definitely give a count there, a good shot when he's off balance and he's definitely give a count there. This fight will be a pivotal moment in Joshua's career. If he can overcome Dubois, 
the path to a big showdown with Fury will be wide open. The knockdown could make it close. The final bell sounds and we will go to the judges. Eight rounds we go to the score. Allinson, he's definitely give a count there. Fury with his back. But if he fails, his future at the top of the boxing world could be in jeopardy. The referee is giving a count. That was a good shot. When he's off balance and he's definitely give a count there. Joshua and Dubois are both preparing the for the pressure of them. Wembley. Good right up a gut. And once again, the legs. This fight will not only determine who comes out on top, but also the fate of their careers in the near future. And already, Isaiah, well, he slipped early on. That little twitch of the knees, that was definitely not a slip. Harry the ref separates them. Good right up a gut. And once again, this is... A slip, the referee's giving a count. That was a good shot. When he's off balance, and he's definitely give a count there. Fury with his back. The knockdown could make it close. The final bell sounds, and we will go to the judges. Eight rounds, we.